Good morning, Internet. Playing for Spire and an Ironclad run today. Level 5. Finally, we made it. Level 5 with Ironclad. We're on par with all our other, our other characters. It is good times ahead. I hope. Rare cards. Rare cards? Remove two cards for a thinner deck. You know what, let's just get a rare card. It's Berserk. I don't get to choose. It's my bad. Gain two vulnerable at the start of the turn. Gain energy. I never picked the card because I don't like it. But maybe, just maybe, it's a great setup card for the Lock of Wulun, for example. It's an energy relic in card form. If you think about it that way, all of a sudden, it's excellent. Now, it's the morning. Fingers are not warmed up yet. Cannot do this epic maneuver. The micromanagement needed to use the controller properly. It's okay, we're getting there. Uh, why did I do that? Don't ask me. We're vulnerable. God damn fingers. Give me two attacks. That is good enough. Okay. Armin's perfect. You know what? Maybe it's time for a perfected strike deck. I know there is a uh, a achievement for using only common for like only common cards. That means I did not get uh, this berserk. Pretty much a bad time to do that. For boomerang. You know what? Let's. It's time. It's been so long since we've done perfected strike deck. Let's have some fun. Let's have some fun. If you get the purple spirits, I'll happily donate. We're not gonna try so hard to get, uh... Get, so, here's the thing, we don't remove. Transform. We transform the Berserk. Gain another card. I go back? I can't go back. I'm, uh, I'm already committed. Alright, send me. Wait a minute. You can transform into a lower rarity? That is, uh, that is, that is heresy, okay? Well, we misplayed. Quite drastically there. Let me tell you, I love to get the uh, metallicized. And we already have a ghost armor, so there's no point to go for the achievement anymore. Let's just take it. Let's just take it. What else can we do? Upgrade the uppercut? Sure. Flood this deck of garbage. We're just we're gonna have an easy morning run playthrough. If you lose, we lose, right? That's kind of the idea right now. And let me tell you, brother, we will lose. This deck is hot trash right now. It's just hot trash. The potion, wild strike, is a strike. So I should add it. Carnage. No, dude, give me the strike. You gotta add strikes to the deck. You gotta smith, and you gotta smith the the perfected strike. Deals three additional damage for all cards containing strike. More combat, more chance to get strikes. I guess. Uppercut doesn't do anything here. Let me ghost armor. Yeah, that looks nice. Give him the vulnerability. Perfected strike. It deals 40 damage. That is good. That is quite good, you see. Uh, status of curse card deals 6 damage to all enemies. Not gonna matter, although I do have wild strikes. I'm gonna keep on taking wild strikes. Let's take it. Hey, but I, I see this uses. I see how it's useful. But you see, we're gonna keep on smithing. 10 damage. Uh, uppercut being upgraded is useful. So is bash being upgraded. Let's let's actually try to ease our victory using something so garbage. This deck is playing by the seat of his pants, which is kinda how I play, so you know. Can't complain. Enter. Laga Wulan, gotta start with uh, I was gonna say, some setup. 
I guess we don't care about ghostly armor. Still have metallicize. We can bash. I don't know. There's a big chance that we drop off a strike next turn. So let's let's eat the, the ghostly armor. And never look back. That's what I'm talking about. The 40 damage is quite massive there. Let's race and do nine. Do you do nine or do you block for five? Let's block for five. There's a world where ornamental fan will trigger and then I would do that, but uh, it's not that day today. Why did I do that? It hardly ma does not matter. I could not get ornamental fan to pop off. Every three attacks. Wasn't gonna do three attacks. Our attacks deal are toss too much mana as I jokingly got rid of uh, Berserk. The perfect situation. But you know. The over? No, he's. Oh. He weakened us. Sorry, he makes us have less strength. I say. This is a defense territory. Okay. Overall, still a good fight. Nunchuck. Okay. Thing attacks gain energy, emerald key, blah blah blah. Heavy blade. You know what? Fire breathing wild strike, perfect strike back. Okay. More than one win condition. Everybody likes it. It's all good. Gave me some block to the passive use of ornamental fan. I had no, I had no like defensive play there, so it's not like I can do anything. What is this deck? I mean, I know what it is. Deck, common deck that needs more resting. You interrupt, and sadly you play a power like a dummy. They're both attacking. Crash, hot trash. But at least you just eat one of them. You perfectly block. That was the perfect draw you needed for that turn. Fire breathing is gonna be useful. To draw slimes and shit. As I do not draw slimes and shit. Okay. And the card. Flame barrier, definitely the take, but there's another wall strike. Just kinda gotta. Kinda gotta, you know? As a single wound. Not even two. This used to be two wounds into your hand. Now it's a wound in your draw pile. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, those don't need to go for the shop. 18 cards. We gotta thicken up that deck, bro. Thicken up the deck, bro. We're blocked. Send you. We get. Uh, should I have not done that? The extra energy could be useful in a later turn. But let me tell you. Ball strike, ball strike, strike. Sounds like the right type of thing. I'm gonna draw. Did not even draw into uh, fire breathing. Neither fire breathing upgraded. In my head somewhere upgraded it. Okay, flame berry is nice. Twin strike is also has striking it. No? But because it's not wall strike and we need a little bit more defense, I'm gonna do the flame barrier. I'll fight the lead either way, let me fight it later. After a regular enemy. These guys. They're jokers. You see you? You. But you deal 8. You go first. Take a bunch of damage I don't want to take. They're all attacking for some freaking stupid reason. You. You get hit for 12, which means uh, you're in range. Of our single wall strikes. The wall strikes also do a lot of damage. For fighting strike number two, this is it. I know Shrug it off is good, but the damage is really pumping, the defense is really pumping. You gotta just keep on going. You gotta keep on keeping on. What is our boss? Fine. I'm tempted. But look at this damage. And you know what? Metallicize. It's on block for at least six defense. Now that I say it that way, doesn't sound too impressive now, does it?
Yikes. Fifteen. Still okay. Still okay. You're done. Do the forty-four strike dummy. We did it. Perfected strike and strike dummy deck. All cards can even strike deal three additional damage. We finally did it. It's part of our this canyon. Um. Wow. This is interesting. Perfected strike number three. Might be too comical. We don't have the energy base to play that. We don't have energy place for the bludgeon either. But power through. 15 blocks and two wounds, which are okay with our other archetype. Let's go for that. And let's upgrade. What do we upgrade? With 44 health, I'm comfortable upgrading. I think. If this run ends on my hubris, then uh, then blame it on me, I guess. I don't know what to say there. Talisize. No, that's not the archetype. The wound conditions are, are these things. Which I'll play more got better fire breathing. Let's slowly inch over every single one. You no? Know? It's a it's a big deck. You cannot ever get to it. I should upgrade the other as a strike you could you could argue. And I say, you know what? You're absolutely right. Absolutely correct. I'm not gonna play the potions yet. I think I don't need it. But maybe I do. He gets a lot of slimes, which would be great if I Drawing into any of them, but I did not. Double wall strike by a lot of status cards in our hand now. Give me fire breathing. I mean, yes, but also no. Yes, but also no. Double fire breathing. Just take a lot of damage. Take a crap on damage. Okay. Take 30 damage. 114. Drew some cards, but at what cost? This is the best split you can hope for. Still keep the ghost armor. Was it the best split? I don't think so. Maybe I should have popped the energy potion there. As I thought about it a second longer. You know what? You pop him. You make him disappear from the planet of Earth. I think we're gonna survive the slime fight. Uppercut, and it's over. We don't heal to fall, it's a bummer. Feed Reaper Offering. What do you think? What do you think? Offering sounds like the, the kind of card that makes things great. Feed though. I like a feed, but do we we don't have a lot of control over when we do damage. Because we drew statuses with fire breathing, sometimes the turn just ends, it's hard to set up. Reaper costs too much mana. Offering, I think, is oh, we need a mana base. As I can say, oh, I don't think I don't think we need any more card choices. I know we still want them. This is suicide because we get rid of our strikes, and we need the energy. Bust the crown at this. All right. Exciting vanilla deck. Uh, picking any path. Picking the midnight train going anywhere. Kind of situation right there. Ball strike you. You know, I'll take some voluntary damage. You don't hit me, I do it myself. I hit myself far a lot there, but I fully blocked you. Okay, you now, don't you feel stupid? This is perfecto. Can do even one more? Okay. If we draw. Into a status, you're done. We did draw into a status, and he was not in fact done, so I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, three! Three upgrading in flame! Yikes! Should not have taken that, but I always do. No, we cannot remove five strikes at this time. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Curse Tome. Give us a book. We take 10 damage. Obtain the book. We get. Nidalee's Codex and the starting turn shuffle. Uh, I don't like this. This is probably the book that I don't like. So at the start of your turn, you can shuffle one of three random cards into your draw pile. We fight. I was hoping for a Necronomicon. But isn't anybody always hoping for a Necronomicon? If you think about it. At the strike. Fire breathing. Give me offering. Gotta, gotta explode over people. 
Got that. Eat Romeo. Romeo is also eat it. Okay. Uh. Try this strike. Dexterity down. Bothers me not, bear. Bothers me not. This is why I don't like. Makes every turn so long. I wish I could just not take it. But I know it increases my win rate by a lot, so. And this deck does need all it can get. Strike. Taking six damage. What is this? What is this trash? Give me the red mask. Liquid memories is more useful than draw. I dare say. Not need a key. Get out of here. Just want to get this over with, you know? Fire breathing, full block, 36 damage for effective strike. And turn. Drug. It's a good practice to think like, do we want this card in my deck? Is that a thing? Is that a thing for us? That's about it. Uh, power proof. I'll take. Fire breathing number two, flame barrier. I don't mind drawing garbage because uh, I deal damage as I do so. Give me a wild strike. Draw me garbage and exploding fire, please. Trench, double my block. I think it could be okay, but no. Let's do some regular old smithing. Sorry for the ping there. And uh, what do we do? Other prophetic strike is a good upgrade target. So there's other fire breathing at this point, but let's do other perfected strike. And then we do other fire breathing. And then we work on our defense cards. There's a warder operations. Let's see. Slavers! The worst enemy you can fight, but uh, if you got the guts, maybe it all works out, you know? Maybe all works out. Did it work out? Not really. Searing blow is trash. Get the card. Take one damage. That is fantastic. That is like the least amount of damage you can possibly take on these things. Uh, curse. We drew into a wound that dramatically helped us. We tell you, we can eat. We want to, but we cannot eat. Oh no, we could eat. At the cost of taking damage. No, no, no. Of course not. We don't even take damage. Okay. Did not look whether that's good or bad. We kind of just be like, no, I don't need this dude. We got this uh, old fashioned way. We got this stuff the old fashioned way. Do we got it the old fashioned way? I don't think we did. We're taking damage. Should I play that turn a little bit more carefully? Should have, would have, you know? Should have, would have. First thing. Six. Ball strike. And felt like I had a lot of damage in the in the hand there, but not in, one energy off from playing everything. He's don't even need to try it. Letter open it. Every time you play three skills in a single turn, deal five damage to all enemies. I welcome it with open arms. Question mark Snackle. I freaking hate Snacko. I sound like a broken record right now. But I hate Snacko. Repeat that for me. We do not like Snacko. Okay? Barbie. Uh, give me a wild strike. Okay. Click too fast. Click too fast there. But you know what? Zero mana cost fire breathing. Flame barrier. Give me an offering. Man, sure. Sure. Yeah. 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 Nope. Take some damage as we drew into garbage and hit him. But, uh. Yikers. Yikes. I don't know. Play the two defense. Super boring. But gets the job done. Super boring. But if you drew into status cards, he's done. Or perfected strikes. We took the damage that we used to take the uh, we spent on offering. Which is a problem, right? We never heal because we always use offering every single combat. Pendograph, heal before 
the boss combat. That is beautiful. That is fantastic. Uh, no. No apparitions, please. The shop is good. But there's also another shop this way, too. Let's go for that. Yo, zero. I understand your pain. Let me tell you, I do sort of understand your pain. Uh, I may have screwed up there. This is full block. But we cannot weaken the enemy anymore. Yeah, okay. Terrible. Terrible place. Think before you play. Maybe. Consider thinking. As I say, thinking? Dude, that's not my thing, dude. And I, I say, you know what? Understand. It's not my thing either. We're the same person. Now this is beautiful. The bird killed himself on us. We're gonna try to not take damage. So we don't need to use offering this time. Impervious. Extra turn. Why not? If you drew in the garbage, I was gonna say he gets yoked and we yoke him some more. Smoke bomb, don't need that shit. Nobody runs away. Upgrade twin strike gaming. Easy pickings. My dude gains uh gain stuff. So let's see if we vulnerability 50 something. Something something. Not enough, huh? Not enough. I have no defense in my deck, so you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do energy potion. So I'm gonna play my whole hand in flame. Start with upper uppercut. I'm gonna pump him full of 63 damage. He's down to three, and then the strike will finish him. Nice. Good use of the potion. Uh wall strike number three. Sure. Better prophetic strikes, right? All for the sake of better prophetic strike. We're going to the shop. Burst into flames. Get the potion, get a colorless card. Now just leave. Take damage. What do we got in the shop? I don't even know what the hell do I want. Is there anything I want to re No? Maybe regular defense? Evolve! When I'm draw a status card, draw additional card. That is an enabler for the archetype, so I guess I'll take that. Three damage all minions. To all enemies, no. Dexterity, useful. Artifact. Uh, heavy hat. If you still had the berserk artifact, would be amazing. Energy relic at that point. I think we take the evolve. We can still take both of these. Now we can take a flex later. But, uh, is that a thing? The boss. Okay, you know what? Give me Dex. Give me, give me. Why not, right? It's every time we spend our gold down to single digits, can't complain too. Can't complain a little bit. We heal with a uh, pantograph. <sighs> As we cure a little bit of that dry throat from talking too goddamn much. I don't need to draw two cards. I just need to draw parity, so status card doesn't flood us. I don't actually need it to draw additional cards. Not as much at least. Fire breathing, number two. 26 card. I think at 30 cards, this deck is too thick. Right now, I can it's still livable. I can, I can live with this. Uppercut for the weekend. We gain energy back. Perfect, I didn't even count on that. Skip the card. Taking nine, but this is the boss, dude. You gotta be okay taking some damage against the boss. Nope. Dual wheel could be good. Could be interesting. Uh, fire breathing number two. Give me a power through. Just so that I can get more statuses. I have my evolve out. Don't need another one. As I said, I don't care about having more, more draw there. Do I need an offering? Sure. Low order, but sure. Uh, she. Sorry, Ghost Armor, but uh, that was insane. Corruption! <laughs> uh, let's not do that. First time we see Twin Strike drawing our deck, I feel. Give me more wounds, that's fine. 
I don't want more wounds. Uh, give me more power too. With double 20 damage, wounds out and can draw more cards. I, I don't mind having any amount of status in my hand right now. It's just alright. Give me more. If you draw into them, it's lethal. Somehow we didn't draw into any of our many wounds, but lethal anyway, so who cares? That felt really good. Yo, 20% of max health, let me tell you. Better than an attack potion. Berserk. We get to try again. <laughs> and we have uh, the artifact this time. Alright. It comes back full circle, you know. Cannot smith. Energy but cannot smith. Cards from my deck. Energy but cannot smith. Yikes. Let me tell you, this is a deck that could be okay without smithing. If anything, right? Because uh, you are adding, it's not low draw consistency. A lot of the cards are not upgraded. The key cards, the two prophetic strikes, two, uh, you know what? The key cards have already been upgraded. This is where you make a value judgment. You just say yes, or you remove bash and you remove uh, berserk. That's the bash and you flame. I can take out bash and you flame. I think on average they're worse. Or Bash and Zerk. But let's not Smith. More energy. But at what cost? Time either. Now, let me just tell you, we can't wait for us to just beat this floor. So let's just beeline the for the victory there. This will be fine. Any path will take us there. Cut. Boss strike. We have five energy, by the way. Remember that. Remember that. I hear a little siren in the background. Something is going on in the neighborhood. Try to not ask too many questions. No. Never ask too many questions. Duplication potion. Strike number three. No, I'm gonna turn that down. It's not upgraded. But it is a strike on its own. It has the worst striking it. Yikes. Before I turned it down because it has an energy base, but it does have a striking it. I forgot that part. Now this is free uh free energy. Okay. But I have no draw here, so do nothing I guess. Shockwave? Sure. Take 3 damage. We heal it back up. That is alright. And plus, we can't smith this time. So we just gotta... Why did I do that? Who knows, dude. Who knows. Could have, uh, should have blocked for sure. Take 2 damage. I felt powerful enough that it's probably blocked enough. And I was wrong. So wrong, in fact. So, so wrong. Power through. Are we taking damage again? Yes, we are because like I just can't start doing math. I just can't be bothered. Cannot be bothered. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Take this away. Do it properly, okay? Second win. No. No, 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 no. No exhaust. Now, this dude, I was gonna say, you need a fire breathing. You need the fire breathing and you need to eat as hard as you can the explosion lord. Gain the block, I'm blocked. Eat you. Take no damage and the rest is all about the fire breathing. The garbage statuses do help. But with this much block, you might as well just uh, he take the five, right? Let's do this. And send you. Okay. Okay, okay. Feeling good. We're feeling good. Flame barrier, why? No. Cover cut you. Do nothing. We have six energy per turn. We're like a nuclear reactor. We draw shit and people just freaking explode. Pummel strike. High energy. 
draw two cards, sign me up. Uh, the Maw. The Maw is usually a little bit problematic, but in this case, who knows? I mean, I'm just playing the, the card so that I don't lose it, because why not? Not because why, just because why not? I don't get cursed. Beacon is the highest amount of defense. Strike is the highest amount of defense as well. Battle Trance would have been good, I think. But my fingers are already committed to movement. And you know what, I'm at the point where I feel comfortable playing, like, not playing optimally. I don't know why. Because this deck can still go wrong anytime, like right now, for example. For example, anything in my discard pile that can save the day here. I don't remember how much uh, Prophetic Strike does, but I think it will save me. So let me pop a Liquid Memory, get a Prophetic Strike, deals enough to kill. That's what I'm talking about, Twin Strike. Why not? Make the strike stronger. Until I realize how bad things are, have me not realized anything at all. Combo strike. Practice strike. We're safe. Spin strike. With the highest amount of damage, I guess. That was only 99 damage? And we can't kill the transient. It's a feels bad man kind of moment. We're gonna take damage against the transient unless I do something about it. That's even more feels bad, man. Yikers. So maybe we're not there yet. Perhaps we are not there. 60 damage, fire bleeding number two. Ball strike, regular strike, block, and more block. And we somehow still take one. Yikes. 70 damage. Inflame. I see a perfected strike. I know we're okay for this turn. We're fine. Yep. Rampage is too slow. One more turn. 80 damage. Let's see. Oh my gosh, this is the worst hand in the in the planet in the history of everything. Can't believe that was the last turn there. We drew into all our defense at the end. Taking damage, liquid bronze. Let's try three upgraded. Let's take it. This could be bad. The giant head. What do I feel about the giant head? I don't know. How do I feel about it? How do you feel? I should play the blocks first. Because you're playing against a giant head. That's useful. Uh, demon form. Give me. Any insurance policy? Any insurance policy? Let me tell you. I need flame double perfected for. 25 damage each, don't mind if I do. I think we're gonna be alright. We are going to be just okay. Now we can. Okay, so. Send it. Send it down Main Street with all the strikes. Do we have lethal? We, we, we probably have lethal, right? If you just play them in the right order. We don't have lethal even if we play them in the right order. But at least we block fully. Forgive me immolate. Why not? We actually drew immolate for the lethal. That is excellent. I mean, I took it just because, hey, maybe we have it for the lethal. Just for the funsies. Doesn't do anything. Reckless charge as a daze into our draw pile. It's like ball strike. But it's not like Wall Strike because he doesn't do ridiculous damage. I mean, Wall Strike only does 12. But it does 12 unupgraded. We can only uh, 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 rest, not smith. So I think it's alright for us to go to rest sites. Give him lower health. Let's eat. Eat some more. Eat some more. First time that I killed the guy on the back. Let me say that much. Powerful run so far, feeling pretty damn good. Now, do we try to go to the heart of this? Let me tell you, 
a stupid idea, but I love it. I love that stupid idea of yours. We're gonna heal. If we don't have, if we can't get there, we can't get there. If we already picked the relic, then we can't get there. We could. Whenever we use a potion, heal five. The dream alive, brother. Don't care about that relic at all. I know it's not bad, it's just not my thing. This eats you fully? Wow. Fine. I could have offering and just like AP push that guy. I think I could, but why bother when you don't need it, right? Level strike does not get me there, so maybe I should have pushed hard on that, but uh, it is done. I'll revive. I'm gonna do all my hard work. I took A damage. Yikes. Kills. This does not kill. Why are these these problems always happening to me? Give me emulate. Taking these dumb damages. I'm not playing optimal. We're not about playing optimal here though. Always drawing that emulate after I play it. it feels good. Headbutt could be an enabler. Could be useful to setting up the prophetic strikes. Our deck is so thick we need a headbutt. Okay. Stop. Hmm. Heal full. That branch is hilarious. You phenomenal. With corruption, if you have you taken it, because corruption makes exhaust all the cards pretty much, and then uh, exhaust all skills. Sorry, and that branch gives you random cards, which could be also be skills. They cost zero. Okay, bound infinitely play. We heal the full. Not the highest value heal, but it's not like we're gonna use our shop gold for anything else unless we go to the heart. I kind of don't feel like going to the heart too. Toss size, sure. Move. What do I want to remove? Dash? I don't want to remove anything. Sure, heal me. Who cares? Dangerous to go along. Give me all your gold. Oh, fuck you too, buddy. You draw. Sure, strike. Oh, there's more? Strike more then. That actually gave me the block I needed. Kind of. Kind of. Okay, so. Two of them are attacking. I have the means of eating. For sure. Almost both of them. That is a block. Ish. In one damage, no big deal here. Uh, let's just call this a day. I'm tired. It's in the morning. I'm already tired. For boomerang, I sleep. Rewards. Question mark, question mark, let's go. Let's fight. Let us fight. If we take so much damage and go to the hard fight, then maybe that's that's what it's supposed to, how it's supposed to be, right? You know? It's just what it's meant to be. Let me tell you. I'm gonna twin strike headbutt the perfected strike. And had I looked at my nunchucks, I could have done something there. Realized that I could have killed the guy one turn. But I didn't. So the misplay is real. Where the hell is my perfected strike? I headbutted it, right? What? I mean, I'm not complaining too hard because I still get a kill, but I, I made a play specifically for that. Just disappeared. Did that twin strike afterwards? I don't remember. But this damage isn't exactly welcome because I wasn't planning on it. 14. That's low enough to want you to skip the hard fight, don't you think? Yeah? Okay. Here you go. Can now gain strings. I'm just gonna gain one strength. For the timekeeper, I think. You begin to fall. Alright, I'll give up a card. Lose a defend. Take a defend, dude. Back there. We're not going to heart. Lift. You can say that's cowardice. I say, you know what? 
for once I agree with you that is definitely cowardice you'll see me you see this this is the face of a coward right here okay inflame metallicize spirit bash who cares one of cars exhaust again three block um, we have a duplication potion. What do you want to use it on? I do not know. Almost strike the draw. This pretty much block us almost fully. This block us exactly fully. Let's play four cards next turn. Let's be a little bit smart about this. We're already blocked. There's no reason to like kill ourselves for no reason. Play four cards. Play two cards. With three cards, with four cards. Add a demon form. It scales. It's web scaling, dude. Play the demon form. It scales. Yeah, I think we're good. I think we're all right. The offering there was, was a good spot there. Could I use two demon forms? Anything? Can tell you headbutt. Headbutt put something on top. I, I played headbutt wrong. I played it like rebound. That's why it didn't work. Oh! Oh! I see. I mean, might as well heal, right? I understand. That's why I got a twin strike on top of the deck. This is where, let me tell you, you pop the duplication potion, you double tap the freaking amazing strike there, and you gotta go for the heal. He heals the, heals the foe, and the time eater is no more. Ascension 5 down, Ironclad. This is what I remember. Can't even get over it, 910, uh, 910 score, without really even trying. Like, you know, walk around, common cards, eh. Anyways, there's no Ascension 7 unlock because a 6 unlock is, uh, we unlocked that a long time ago. But hope you enjoyed the content. If, leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it, uh, comment. Subscribe to the channel, helps me out a lot, and I'll see you next time. Yeah.